Smart navigation widgets uh, have two uh, main settings to allow use of non-hierarchical taxonomies and use of non-hierarchical post types. Some of the plugin features will not work properly if one of these options is selected and if you select taxonomy that is not hierarchical or post type that is not hierarchical. Data archives widget allows you to display date-based hierarchy for archives. Set the title, who will be able to see it, and uh, then you can go to setting up the uh, widget. Select uh, the levels for the archives. It can go from decades to days, years, months, and days of default. And you can select uh, uh, root items to show. Full hierarchy will display all uh, date archives in range for available archives and the based on the current date will uh, detect uh, the current date archives and display uh, only levels belonging to that current uh, archive. We'll see a bit later how that works. Here you can set number of items to show on the first level. That's the level displayed with the, uh, when the page is loaded. We'll put uh, four here and we can set six here, for instance. You can select sort order and uh, it's descending and ascending. And if you use decades, you can set which URL to use. Since decade is not uh, a real uh, archive type in WordPress, it doesn't have its own URL, so you can uh, set it to no link or to the first year in the decade. As with all the other widgets, you can select slide uh, uh, or fade in for animation method, animation speed and uh, predefined style for uh, displaying the widget. When you set to all that, save. And here it is. Right now we are seeing four uh, elements in the first level. Fifth is here. When you open this one, we will get uh, the list of uh, months available. There are only two months in 2013. If you open this, you will see more. And so on. But in this case, if you open this year, you will again see the full archives for this widget. If you switch to based on the current date for root item, when we are on the home page, you will see the whole hierarchy. But if you switch to a year, you now see months in that current year. If you open further, you will see days. If you switch to this month here, you will see days for that particular month. Taxonomy's Archive is a widget to show you terms belonging to selected taxonomy. Uh, setting title and uh, who to see the plugin is uh, as with all the other plugins. You can set animation method and speed and select style as all the other plugin, uh, all the other widgets in this plugin. Here you need to select a taxonomy to use. Uh, by default, only hierarchical taxonomies are displayed. Hat categories is usually uh, the one most websites use. You can display posts count for each category. Next, you need to select the way to display root uh, items for uh, this taxonomy and the full hierarchy is uh, default. How many items to show on first level and uh, inner levels. Sort column and sort order and also you can set which terms to exclude from display let's say these two
and here it is this is the first level you can drill down to see more Uh, depending on how you select uh, root items, we can switch to selected ca select custom term. And we need to select which term to use as root. We'll set it to this one. And that means that uh, first level we sh will show terms belonging to the selected uh, uh, item here. Now you see only terms belonging to that one. Third method is to use this option here. So it will detect the root term and display only items belonging to it. So we'll switch to home. All taxonomy terms are displayed here. but if you switch to blog, you will get the blog archives here and you will see only terms belonging to currently selected category. If you go to this one, you only see this. We'll go back. If you select a term that has no child terms like this one, you will still get to see terms belonging to the parent of the current term. So the same level as before will be displayed here and you can navigate from there. Hierarchy content can be used to display posts belonging to hierarchical post types. By default this is pages. Uh, pages are default uh, post type in the WordPress and it's a hierarchical post type. So we'll select pages and uh, most other settings are similar to other two widgets and you will uh, have options to select animation method and uh, style. Exclude some of the posts by selecting one or more of them. And uh, you can select number of items to show in each level and to uh, sort items. Menu order is default one for hierarchical uh, post types. You can switch to different root items to show. Uh, full hierarchy is a default one. And let's see it. You have all posts belonging to this uh, post type here. There are a lot of them here and we can go through the list uh, like with other uh, widgets. Uh, you can switch to uh, hierarchy that is based on a current post. But first, let's see uh, when you select a custom post as a root. So we'll switch to this one here. So this item will be default one and we will see only a uh, post belonging to it. So in this uh, case, only posts belonging to uh, the one we selected on the admin side will be displayed. And of course, you can set to use current post uh, as a base uh, for display. So if we are on a home page, uh, we'll see all posts like this. But if you switch uh, to some of the uh, some post, let's see this one. You will see that post displayed, and of course, widget will switch to display only posts belonging to current one.